On Thursday, a group of migrants that once numbered as many as 5,000 were split on whether to keep walking through southern Mexico towards the U.S. border. 2,000 mainly younger male migrants have set up walking from the Mexican town of Huitzla. But many families with children tired from walking some 40 kilometers the past two days and decided to wait to see if they could get some sort of temporary visa. Ser yo durante estos dos meses y medio hasta que me salga mi visado. Si con este papel de esta citatoria no me dan la oportunidad de trabajo en ningún lado. Simplemente yo quiero abandonar México. Yo no quiero quedarme en México. Y menos dos meses y medio. ¿De qué me voy a mantener yo? Por eso es esta caravana, porque simplemente todos queremos salir del país, no nos queremos quedar aquí. Defense Oversight Director of the Washington Office on Latin America, Adam Isaacson, said many decide to join these caravans to avoid months of dire poverty in southern Mexico. Venezuelans make up large proportion of this caravan. A factor appears to be a policy change implemented by Mexico in January requiring Venezuelans to acquire a visa to enter the country. Finding consensus on managing migration flows in the region was a top priority for a representative meeting this week at the Summit of the Americas in Los Angeles. If you're following Mexican law, you're awaiting in Mexico's poorest state, the southern state of Chiapas, uh, for more than a year with few economic opportunities for a decision for the asylum that would give you the document you need to travel around the country freely um, and whether you plan to stay in Mexico or not. And so now Venezuelans who until recently were able to just fly to Mexico and get a tourist visa are being forced to take the same path. Recently, the Mexican government has disbanded other caravans by offering to move migrants to other cities where they could legalize their status more quickly. In some cases, the government has tried to tire the migrants out by preventing passing trucks and buses from giving them rides.